Hello there! In this video I want to show you how to create a YouTube scraper using Google Sheets and YouTube API. By the end of this video you will know how to manipulate cells in Google Sheets, how YouTube API works and how to create a script which scrap from YouTube the titles and the links for the videos that you search for. For example, let's search for the word tree. We run the script and we get 42 results. If we go back in sheet, we see the results. If we search again, we will get another set of results. Let's take it step by step. First thing you need to do is go to your Gmail account. Then go to Sheets and create a new sheet. Put some values in the cells so later we can work with that. I already have the script on so I will try to respect the position for the cells. Now go to Extension then select App Script. Here we can add any JavaScript functionality, logic and whatever we want. Let's make a test and read the value from one cell and then print it here. When we run the script for the first time, we need to permit access for the script to read and write to the file which is in Google Drive. To activate YouTube API service, go to Services, then scroll down and select YouTube Data API V3. Add a name for the service or you can let it like this and click Add. Now we have the service in the list and we can use it to make the first API call. Go to YouTube API documentation and check a bit how it works. You can make also calls there to test the service and after that you will see what kind of object we need to construct in our script to have the good and the wanted results. Back to code, let's use the API YouTube service. We make a minimal snippet request where we put only the keyword and published after date. You need to be careful what kind of data you put in the request because they need to be in a specific format. You can check it here with debugger or directly on the site on developersgoogle.com. Also to get the object that you need from the response, you can use debugger to stop the script and check exactly what you want. And here we go, we have the first call on API and we scrap the data, taking it only the title and the link for the first video. Now that you know how it works, let's go to the entire script and check a bit what I did here. In the first part, we make some variables with the values from the cells. Then we create the request object. In here we put the keyword, the maximum results and after we correct the date because this needs to be in a specific format to have a good request and get results. I made the API call and I took the needed objects. I put the values in variables for title and links. Then I created a filter which checked the title for the keyword. After that I inserted the keywords to the corresponding cells. And if the page token is used, we correct the position where to insert the results. This filter is needed if you want to have the keyword as exact match in the video titles because YouTube algorithm returns as results videos that has your keyword only in description and we want to have it only in the title. With this being said, I will put a link in the description with the code. Please let a comment, a like or dislike, hit subscribe and if you want you can propose me a subject for the next videos. Thank you for watching.